It's a busy time for tow truck drivers right now following all the rain that we've had this week. Some cars still stranded on the road. So let's go now to local 10 news reporter Annalise Garcia. She's live in Hallandale Beach this midday. I don't think they can work fast enough. Yeah, Christy Janice, we've been here all morning long and we've definitely see the work continue as the morning has progressed. We've seen tow truck drivers arrived and there there were about 10 cars behind me earlier and now you can see there's one left there, another left here with its trunk wide open. Neighbors have been talking about how the traffic has had to divert around these cars. It is causing an issue, but uh, tow truck drivers are doing their best to make sure that they all get picked up. Cars underwater in Hollandale Beach. This cell phone video taken Wednesday night. They didn't tow these out of here yesterday. Friday morning, these cars still sitting stranded due to the severe flooding. Neighbors say the water was to their waistline in the middle of the street at one point. Dozens of cars stalled out, abandoned. People who live in the area also concerned for their cars parked outside of their homes. I was just worried that the car wasn't going to start off. Like all of us was worried for our cars. Our cameras rolling as residents came outside to clean up and try to start their vehicles. Most of these cars, that one over there doesn't turn on anymore. Sasha Solano is lucky hers did. This here is on Northeast 14th Avenue and Moffett Street, but cars are stranded all over eastern Broward County. Oh, it's a ton. I mean, it's, it's, it's definitely thousands. They're everywhere. I mean, this is not only the only area. We spoke to a tow truck business owner who says he's doing what he can to help. We've been out here all night. Um, you know, just trying to get everything in order and clearing up some of the roads and just kind of moving some of the cars to the side and stuff like that. He tells us they deal directly with insurance companies. Once they call in and everything like that, call their insurance and then their insurance company send us out. People in the neighborhood now trying to pick up the pieces. So definitely a work in progress out here. If your car stalled, stalled out during this storm, you'll definitely want to give your insurance a call if you haven't already or a tow truck company. I'm live in Hollandale Beach, Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.